Before 12 a.m., the Black Sea held its breath. A silence so perfect it felt wrong. Somewhere beyond the horizon, something was moving. Small, fast, and armed with purpose. A 16-foot phantom sliced through the glassy water, its fiberglass hull whispering against the waves, nearly invisible to radar. On its back, three FPV drones, each no larger than a backpack, but each carrying a 1.5-pound shaped charge designed to melt steel like paper. Miles away, a Russian patrol ship patrolled Crimea's southern flank, confident and methodical. Then, light. Flashes tore through the night, alarms howled across the deck, interceptors streaked into the sky. But half the sky was a lie, a decoy theater meant to draw fire. And while the Russians fought phantoms, the real threat crept closer, unseen, unstoppable. 33 seconds from now, the illusion would end, and the Black Sea would answer with fire. One question, could the ship's air defenses react in time? In the next eight minutes, you will discover how 15 decoys, three Magura V5, and FPV drones turned a Russian patrol ship in just four minutes. Could a small swarm of drones really outsmart billion-dollar warships and change the rules of naval warfare forever? This is not news. This is a cinematic breakdown of strategy, deception, and precision in modern warfare. A story that goes beyond headlines, beyond TV reports, and reveals how courage, intelligence, and tactical brilliance shape the battles that decide the future of freedom. If you're watching, drop a comment with where you're watching from. Your voice matters. Every like, share, and subscribe is more than support for the channel. It's a stand with Ukraine, honoring the brave men and women whose strategy, skill, and determination are defending their homeland against aggression. Did you know? Tonight, the hunter became the hunted. Here's what happened. 200 kilometers away, Ukrainian operators sat in a dimly lit control room, eyes fixed on the live feed. Their tools weren't tanks or jets. They had data, timing, and deception. Overhead, high-altitude reconnaissance drones watched from beyond radar reach. Below them, cheap kamikaze decoys, built from civilian parts, buzzed toward their targets. And behind it all, the true killers waited. Magura V-5C drones, armed and silent. The mission, cripple a Russian patrol ship guarding Crimea's southern route and send a message that no corner of the Black Sea was safe anymore. Every second mattered. On the screens, Russian radar began to react. The ship's defense grid lighting up. Missiles primed. Targeting systems locked. The Ukrainians knew. Once the first shot was fired, there would be no turning back. They were about to make Russia fight ghosts and lose to the real thing. The decoy swarm came first. Slow, loud, obvious, exactly as planned. Within minutes, Russian radar operators picked up dozens of signals racing across the water. Contact, multiple UAVs incoming, shouted an officer. Sirens wailed, crewmen sprinted to battle stations. Onboard cannons rotated, missile tubes flared open. Then, the night sky exploded. Interceptors streaked upward, tearing apart one drone after another. Each detonation painted the waves in orange and smoke. To the crew, it felt like triumph. Defense working perfectly. But they didn't realize every missile they fired, every round they spent, was part of the trap. Each explosion meant fewer defenses for what came next. While the decoys burned in the sky, the real Magura V5 drones was already on the move, cutting through the water from a different bearing. Low, silent, invisible. In a hidden command van, Ukrainian operators stayed calm. No shouting, no panic, just precision. Magura 1, confirm signal lock. Confirmed. Advance, Delta Vector. The Magura V5 responded instantly, adjusting course in perfect synchronization. Their onboard cameras streamed back real-time infrared. The glowing silhouette of a Russian patrol ship reloading after its false victory. Timing was everything. Ukraine's intelligence team had calculated the ship's reload window. 90 seconds when every system would go silent. At second 32, they initiated final approach. At second 61, they armed warheads. At second 88, they struck 
From command, a single order echoed. Execute. Let them see what silence can do. It wasn't brute force. It was mathematical warfare. Every move predicted. Every second controlled. This was discipline disguised as destruction. The Russian ship's radar went dark, jammed by the last decoy drones before they fell. For a moment, the sea went quiet again. No signals, no threats, no alarms. Then, out of nowhere, the first Magura Vi-5 slammed into the ship's stern. The second hit the command deck, tearing through steel and electronics. The third, the perfect strike, pierced midship, right above the ammunition bay. The result wasn't a battle, it was a collapse. Engines failed, power vanished, fire spread through the corridors, and in that silence between explosions, one truth became clear. The hunters had become the hunted. Flames climbed 50 meters high as secondary blasts tore through the vessel. Its hull split open like paper, each explosion rolling across the water. From the Ukrainian control center, operators watched in silence. No cheers, no shouts, only quiet acknowledgement. Mission complete. Rescue beacons flickered from the wreck. Crew members jumped into lifeboats, their ship engulfed in fire. For months, this patrol vessel had hunted Ukrainian sea drones. Now, it was their proof that a $250,000 drone swarm could outsmart a $65 million warship. Technology had changed the rules. Precision and deception had replaced brute force. And somewhere deep in Sevastopol, Russian commanders knew the Black Sea was no longer theirs. When the smoke cleared, only wreckage remained. Blackened steel drifting in calm waters. Satellite imagery confirmed it hours later. Another Russian patrol ship gone. Crimea's defenses thinner than ever. This wasn't just a strike. It was a signal. That innovation and intelligence could rewrite naval warfare. Ukraine hadn't just destroyed a ship. They destroyed an illusion. The myth that Russia still controlled the Black Sea. And for every strategist watching that night, one truth became impossible to ignore. Firepower wins battles. Strategy wins wars. But strategy alone is never enough. Behind every flawless strike lies obsession. Sleepless hours, silent rehearsals, and men who gamble their lives on precision. The next war won't be decided by numbers or medals, but by minds willing to adapt faster than the enemy can react. Because in modern warfare, victory isn't shouted. It's calculated, measured in milliseconds, and written not in smoke, but in silence. If you believe precision and discipline matter more than size, subscribe and see how the next generation of warfare is being written. One silent strike at a time.